Alright, so a few things. In my last two videos, which will have to be split in parts because of my time period, I noticed that I didn't explain why he's still alive after the kind of shattering of the soul because I had a time period for each drawing and I had to explain it quickly and I'm sorry I'm gonna try and explain it now really quick in five minutes um by the way this is a quick thing this is the song that inspired shards is called Mr. Glass Man by Scotty Sire thank you I'm sorry if I said the last name wrong but thank you for the song it helped inspire uh, an amazing character that I personally adore Okay, so the reason why Shards is still alive after the Shattering is because this, by the way, this is really hard to explain. Uh, <laughs> basically, b b uh, d d d <laughs> before before he had Shattered, he was a mirror. The soul kind of had a, from what I imagine, it was kind of a protective layer. Like, you know when windows usually get two layers? A kind of a thick one and then a thin one or a thick on both that kind of thing it's that kind of like thing for shards of soul the first layer got shattered because of the thing the first layer was a kind of something to hide his own personality to hide his own person it was a mirror that only that could only reflect what was on the outside and then once that kind of disappeared he was free to make his own decisions he was free to do his own thing he was well free Thanks, Glitch. Don't know if it was worth it because he lost a lot of his powers. He lost his arm. He lost everything apart from a healing ability. I forgot to mention that as well. Basically, um, when the soul shattered, it took his abilities with him. It took the whole wings. It took the ability to melt glass. It took everything away. Um, it shattered his arm because obviously having a soul shattered it would affect physical abilities like if sans dusted it would affect his physical physical body um it affected his kind of speech as well i forgot to mention that he's a mute i forgot a lot of important things because of the time period but um he's a mute he can't speak he uses the scarf which is magic but again i'm horrible i forgot to mention the scarf kind of speaks for him, he just thinks it, and the words appear on it that you can read, again, like, the nobles, in spite of the nobles. Thanks for making that, it helped in a direct character. Um, that's pretty much how he can, you know, communicate. His voice is gone, power is gone, arm is gone. Um, the only thing that's left is his healing ability, because that's... M I imagine healing comes more of the second layer of the soul, which is kind of more important and helps him get around. He, he can't teleport either, he has his friends do that for him. Because he can't kind of... Um, he can only heal, that's kind of the sad thing about him. But that's why he's still alive, there were two layers, one which kind of reflected everything, which was his original, and the shattering, which was kind of a reveal to the second layer but i don't personally i don't think it was worth it i don't uh, if you had to lose uh it's a very hard and contradicting topic especially with shards but if you kind of had um two separate things like happiness for your humanity i don't know <laughs> that's up to, that's up to you i suppose would you rather lose your fake self in order and a ton of abilities that you love for hap uh, for having your own body also the reason he's such a selfless person um the soul the second soul kind of went off the first thing he's learned the last the last and first thing he knew was protect glitch be kind to him be selfless be selfless that's pretty much his last first last and first four be selfless and that's his whole deal personally i think it's sweet that's why he's such a selfless martyr as again a friend sansi said that's all i can say on him um sorry i missed all out i again i have a very specific time period i can say these things this song is by week by ajr um 
that's kind of the extra on shards and thank you for listening